What's up, y'all? I already know what y'all thinking. When he gonna post another real podcast? You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna do that next week. I already got it laid out for y'all. Um, but today, I'll give you another story time. Not the story time y'all been hearing. But it's a different one that I was gonna post last week, but you know, I took a little light next last week. Oh, you talking about the what is it about? What is this called? A bonnet? Lisa bonnet? You know what? Uh, what is this called, Gordon? A bonnet. Okay, it's a bonnet. You know I'm just letting my hair, you know, fry in here. This thing hot as I don't know what. But, you know, gotta keep it moist. I'm so you don't like that word. Gotta keep it uh, not dry. So, oh, no, Gordon. That's, that's a conditioning cap. I'm sorry. This is a conditioning cap? It's a conditioning cap. This is a conditioning cap, not a bonnet. She told me it was a bonnet. What I'm gonna talk about. Like I said, it's supposed to be last week because that weekend, before last weekend, was me and Courtney's anniversary. And I just want to let y'all, for y'all that got a real one, it's, it's, it's nice, man. I knew, I've been knowing she was a real one since our first date when I only had $22 in my pocket and she fought the, late, the waitress because they took too long, so they cut our bill in half and I only had to pay $10. That's when I knew she was real. But this one, this date I'm about to tell y'all about is when I really, really Okay, so I found out she's a pescatarian. And if you don't know what a pescatarian is, it's someone who only eats seafood. As she puts it, no land animals. So she only eats seafood. And so I'm like, what's the best seafood spot I can think of? Red Lobster. So, you know, I give her the idea. She said, I like it, I like it. I'm like, cool, bet. So um, we plan for it, get all dressed up. You know, this is like our second date. So, you know, I'm trying to, I'm courting. So I'm trying to, I'm courting Courtney. So I'm trying to get it. So we go. I pick her up in my car. We drive to Red Lobster. And you know, everything's going smooth. They didn't take her up with the food. It was nice and everything. I don't know what she ordered, but I had that with that all you can eat shrimp. Boy, going crazy. Oh, it was delicious. And it was just, it was just a bunch of shrimp slathered in butter. Remember that. You know what I'm saying? Day's going smooth. I'm giving her a nice conversation. She's liking the trip, you know. <laughs> Come on, man. She, she, she like me. I like her. We just talking, conversating, getting to know one another. And so, you know, I pay, you know what I'm saying, big ball. I got more than $22 in the pocket now. I got, I got 32 now, so I can buy $5. And then we go back um, to her dorm, her and her roommates there. So I'm going to hang out with them um, for a little bit. So I get there, and I'm like chilling everything's going well and like i just hear her. i'm like what would that is why uh tricky y'all still messing up with some lighting we watching i think we watching the office the next thing i'm like what would that be i said is the room it gotta be settled somewhere someone moving furniture or something and then just like that it hit me. stomach bubbling going crazy and i'm like bro I gotta go use the bathroom, though. I gotta go. And, like, I just, I just get up and I leave. And I'm like, hey, I'm gonna be back. I'm about to go take a shower. And she was like, okay. <laughs> so I leave. And, cause I didn't want to use the bathroom at her spot. Anybody want to try to hear me blow their bathroom up? So I'm like, all right. So I'm gonna go. And I leave. And I go to my dorm, which is just not that far from there. So I go, I walk to my dorm. I lied, not walk. I pull out sprinted to my door. And you know what? I, I take care of business. I ain't got no details, but I take care of business. I, I, I real deal had to shower after that. Oh, you nasty! That whole process was like an hour and a half. It was all that butter. That butter was too much. I think I'm lactose intolerant. That butter was too much for me. All that stuff. I come, I call her like, yo, I hope. I can still come in. I mean, I know I kind of blown you off for an hour and a half. Like, she was texting me, like, are you all right and stuff? And I'm just in the bathroom, screaming out my lungs, just making my roommate uncomfortable. It was a, it was a tough time. And I wasn't responding to nothing. It's because I wasn't focused on where I was focused on surviving. And that's what you got to do in those times is focus on surviving. Because duty calls. And I did not mean that to pun it anyway. She was fine with it. She didn't get mad. She didn't even know what happened to me. Uh, I told her like last year and she's still with me hey beautiful hello 
You still like me even though my guts is real bad. I'm still here. That's on the love, y'all. I got all that to say, keep you a real one, man. Keep you a real one around. And you know, if you gotta go, sometimes be real with me. Not me though, I had to throw that take a shower. <laughs> I was gone for like an hour and a half, almost two hours. But I just wanted to post something today. I told y'all I was posting everything. Y'all thought I was playing, this ain't no game. I'm gonna post this for today, tell y'all a little, little quick, little funny little store. And then I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow. I'm gonna post gameplay Thursday, Friday, Saturday, probably Sunday too. Until next time, y'all, I gotta get out from under this conditioning cap since it's not a bonnet that Courtney told me it was a bonnet. It's a conditioning cap. It, it's baking my head right now. Like my brain's being fried right now. Peace and love, y'all. I'm out. <laughs>